Tim, at the beginning, was a guest star. And then he was asked to bring in his own material, to bring in six sketches. Again, I think it was really six, <laughs> same amount. And he hired Kenny and me to write six sketches for him, knowing that we were on the show and that we would probably, you know, know what would be good for him and what to do. And one of those sketches was the dentist sketch. And it kills me, because every single time it's mentioned, it's mentioned that Tim wrote it. And it just, it kills me, because he added to it. So it's like a really 50-50, eh, maybe 60. 60-40 type of proposition, because the dentist sketch had the premise of a dentist on his first day at work, which was, a, I mean, that's a typical sketch premise, the first day of, you know, because it's, you, you know, it's going to be funny because they're going to mess up. And so we wrote a dentist on his first day at work, and I think it was just supposed to be Novocaine in the hand. Well, I mean, the way we pictured it, it was going to happen pretty quickly, and it would atrophy and whatever. I mean, Tim made it go on for, you know, um, 20 minutes, that laugh. Harvey really lost it. He was the patient in the dental chair. And then Tim went on from there, and he did improvise. He was the only one on the show who did, and he... And he did it to make Harvey laugh. Anything he, you know, or Carol at times, but, but mainly Harvey. And he took the needle and he put it in his leg and he fell to the floor. And I, th I think, I, I don't remember which was first, but he put the needle in his head and the f expression on his face, and we did not do this. We did not add that, that was Tim. And he was brilliant, and he's a, he's a really good writer himself. And but it's still, I'm glad that I am given the opportunity to get it on record that we wrote that sketch first.